Hey, good morning, and TJIT. Thank goodness it's Thursday. So just a reminder, we do not have school on Fridays as of right now. If you want to, you can use that time as your catch up for work. Um, so I'm just gonna go through and run through what to do for math. All right, so today is a little bit different for your classwork, I'm trying to change it up and have some fun. So it says TGIT, thank goodness it's Thursday, last day of the week for us. Have a great weekend. Okay, for today I have something a little different. I have a math scavenger hunt. All right, so you're gonna complete the scavenger hunt and send me a picture of your completed scavenger hunt items. You may answer the scavenger hunt questions on a separate piece of paper or print out the scavenger hunt and complete it that way, whatever you have at home, okay? Then complete the problem of the day. So you can go ahead and click on this. All right, so it says for May 7th, if the cost of a bat and a baseball combined is $10.10 and the bat costs $7.05, how much is the ball? You'll go ahead, write in your answer and hit submit. Okay. Now, for the math scavenger hunt, I have a math scavenger picture submission. If this is too much and you can't figure out how to do this, I completely understand. And you can just email me the pictures instead. I know that um, that might be a little bit easier. But um, so here it is. It says find two pencils and a blue crayon. How many items do you have? Okay, so you're going to take a picture of those two pencils and the blue crayon. All right. You do not have to take individual pictures either. You can take one whole picture of all of this if that makes it easier once you get them all. Find five blocks and two pennies. Take away three blocks, how many are left? Find four socks and two stuffed animals. How many items do you have all together? Find eight crackers, eat four of them, how many are left? Find three spoons, four books, and one orange crayon. How many items do you have all together? So once you have all the items, you can go ahead and just take a picture for me. Um, if that makes it easier just to do one. Otherwise, like I said, you can take individual pictures. I hope this is something fun and something light. You do not need to worry about doing an I know it for math. All right. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Thanks, guys.